Hey, what's up everyone? Um, Scamper is not doing so well. It's been one crazy event after another regarding our um, different situations, but Scamper, I call him Scamper, his ear right there, you can see his ear, he was looking at me like, do something, and I gave him some antibiotic that I had left over. He got up and went over there, went over to me, and uh, if you're wondering, yes, the Christmas tree is still up. We left it up. We just left it up all this time. We just decided to leave it on up. Um, it's actually left it up for a few years now. But we might take it down. I don't know. But right now, Scamp's ear is really swollen. And this is uh, earlier. He, he got up just earlier and just came to me. And he... He wanted me to take care of him. He was just falling over, so I've given him antibiotic we had left in the vet. We're, we're going to have to take him back to the vet, probably. So that came up suddenly out of nowhere. And so we're probably going to have to take him tomorrow to the vet on Thursday because they're closed today. He was begging me for help, falling over, and I gave him canned food and some water, put him in the garage, let him stay in there for a while. He slept, and then he ca he got up in the morning and, and got out. He felt a little better, gave him some more antibiotic. He felt a little better after that. And then right now he's resting. He came in the house. He, he begged to, for me to pick him up, so I did. And then he just kind of he ate some tuna. I gave him some tuna. And he uh, felt a little better. And apparently Maui, Maui, he came in here really sweetly to Mao. To the, she was laying in that chair. And he touched her really lightly like, I'm here. So he doesn't wake her up and scare her. And she just looked at him and just let him crawl up on top of the box over there. And just sit there and, that she usually likes to sit on. He let her just stay there. She let him stay there, I mean. And then later, she got down and gave him her chair. I was shocked. I couldn't believe it. He gave, She gave him her chair. And he is the best cat. I mean, I hope nothing happens to him. I mean, I'm telling you. Because he's, he has the personality of Hugh, and Hugh died, and then it's just one thing after another. Then recently... I had Bruce, and Bruce was the protector, and he passed, he got, yeah, he's, 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 he's gone, um, Benson, I haven't seen him, he got run off by some weird cat, I don't know, just this odd, strange looking, almost like a replica of him, of him. <laughs> it looks just like him, and apparently got run off by that cat, and, uh, then, there's one that looked like Midnight, but, I don't know, where in the world, she just suddenly, was found on the road I saw her but it's not ours so our cats pretty much stay right here except for Benson I don't know I think Benson's gone now I don't know for sure and then Lizzie just disappeared on the 11th of March but we're gonna take him to the vet tomorrow and hopefully he'll do better I hope he does I hope he does well I hope everything goes okay I don't know what they'll do they, I forgot what they call that with the ear. So, I mean, it's ear hematoma or oral oral hematoma. Oral hematoma, not oral, but oral. And uh, it's where blood gets built up into the ear. And it becomes like a balloon. And they say they get over it within weeks. But I don't know if he'll last that long, the way he's feeling. He shakes his head a lot and falls over. I've had an earache myself and felt pretty rough. And I don't know, it's just like one thing after another. But I I went and mowed the yard yesterday. I went out and mowed the yard and I put it on TikTok for some reason. I just I put that on TikTok when I mowed the yard. But I went out and mowed the yard and uh, got all of that done before the heavy rain came in. And then it poured rain all night. We get a lot of rain here. And now the wind's blowing at like 60, 70 miles an hour earlier. It started. It almost blowed me over. When, it, when, it, when the wind blows me over, that's a big wind. Destroyed the neighbor's barn doors. The wind did. It took them off. And it is, uh... It's been very windy today. It wasn't even supposed to be, but it is. 
and my thoughts are with the people down in Louisiana and those southern states, Texas, and down below in Georgia, Alabama, Louisiana, Texas, all of those states, it's rough. And uh, there was a YouTube channel called Ryan Hall, I believe, that talked about it and said it was coming up, those storms would be coming, and they did. They they packed a wallop for, for the south. I mean, for the, the deep south, it was rough. And... Yeah, my thoughts are with everyone. Not only that, but the escalating situations taking place worldwide. Anyway, I just thought I would share a little bit about Scamper here. And I have not felt well myself. I've started getting draggy. And blah. <laughs> but I'm hanging in there, holding on, holding strong. And I have my ups and downs. It's so weird. But I, um... Mao is walking in here right now really slowly but I've tried to drink a lot of juice and stuff like that exercise and did a lot of footsteps yesterday a lot of walking but oh now Maui's looking at him hopefully she's okay with it it's okay, kid, kid. It's okay, kitty. She's smelling of him. She knows he doesn't feel well. But, anyway, I just thought I would talk a little, about, a little bit about what's going on. I did some yard work yesterday. Picked up a bunch of limbs. Man, there's been a lot of limbs in this rain. This is not a relaxational video. This is just a life update video. I'll talk later. Much love, everyone. Oh, I was talking yesterday at this, everyone was just like, wanting to talk to me yesterday, that's, I guess that's the Leo personality, <laughs> everyone wanted to, life, Leos are the life of the party, right, anyway, anyway, I wanted, to, I talked to people, I was, we went up to Hardee's and I wanted to get some chicken and, uh, one burger, and I did, and, uh, they were like, constantly talking to me this guy was talking about Scooby-Doo and he said man they have ruined Scooby-Doo but he thought they ruined it he liked the original he was a fan of the original Scooby-Doo he grew up watching that and Spongebob and uh, he was talking about that that was pretty funny but I'll talk about that sometime just for the fun of it anyway much love and peace everyone